What's up guys, welcome back to Smart Sim Tech. So today I checked out the new PMS50 Garmin GTN 750. So it's available uh, for free, it's in a beta version. I'll put the link in the description below. Uh, they've teamed up with Navigraph. You've got all the latest maps and data and charts available that are integrated into this uh, great little touchscreen, uh, easy to use, and it's now available in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. So I've downloaded it, you can see here I've got my touchscreen, uh, I've got my GCU that I've got from Real Sim Gear. that's also um, allowing me to zoom in and out on the map. Uh, pretty cool, and they, so they're talking to each other pretty well. And yeah, the touchscreen functionality is great. I do have to double tap everything on here, so I think that's just a, a setting within the software or within possibly Microsoft Flight Simulator. Um, look forward to that becoming a single tap, so if anyone does know uh, anything about that, let me know, because on Air Manager I do only have to tap it once, so yeah, I was looking forward to trying to change that in the future. But um, yeah, so it's available for the Cessna 172, uh, both the Diamonds, the DA40 and the DA62s, including the modded versions, and the G36 and the Grand Caravan. So also there's a couple of uh, third-party developers that have incorporated it. So we've got the H135 helicopter and uh, Just Flight have mentioned they're going to put it into their PA28 Arrow. So So I didn't know too much about the Garmin GTN 750 prior to this. I've had a lot of fun with it in the short time that I've had it today and uh, look forward to keeping it in a couple of aircraft moving forward. I do want to become proficient with it. There's so much functionality in the GTN 750. Um, you've got all your flight plan data. You've got, like I said, Navigraph's maps in there. Uh, if you're on a subscription with them, you get to utilize all the up-to-date real-world maps, which is just amazing. Uh, you can tune your comms. You can... Um, do your direct to functions, all your approaches, your flight plans, everything. So uh, zoom in and out with the map. You can check uh, live weather on the radar. And yeah, it's pretty cool. You've got so many options in there that I haven't even figured out yet. Um, so if I was you guys, I'd head over there, hit the link in the description below, check it out and um, let me know what you guys think if you come back to the channel, if you enjoyed it hit the like button, and if you want to see more videos like this moving forward, hopefully it's been helpful, and I look forward to bringing them to you guys. So um, hopefully see you on the next one, and thanks for tuning in.